Congratulations, you've completed the course. You should now have a solid introductory level understanding of how to build custom Alexa skills, and hopefully you're pretty close to having your first skill completed. From here, you'll wanna practice what you've learned so far and then move on to some more advanced topics. And here are some suggestions for possible next steps. First, head over to dabblelab.com learn. There you'll find links to all of the resources that I mentioned in this course. And you can also subscribe to get notified when this course is updated or when I publish a new course. I am planning on publishing more advanced courses. So hopefully if you liked this one and you wanna dive deeper, you'll wanna check those out too. Also, Alexa is constantly evolving and as a result, this course will have revisions. So by subscribing, I'll let you know when those updates happen. Next, you'll wanna check out the Dabble Lab YouTube channel at youtube.com slash Lab. There you'll find over 50 Alexa development tutorials that complement this course. You'll also wanna to go to github.com slash Alexa to learn more about the Alexa SDK for Node. And while you're there, start digging through some of the code for the sample skills that Amazon provides. And we've also created some sample code starter templates that you can use, and you'll find those at skilltemplates.com. Well, that's it. I really hope that you enjoyed the course, but I also hope that you'll let me know if there is anything that you think I can do to make it better. Finally, if you have any questions about anything that I've covered, don't hesitate to leave a comment and I'll respond just as quickly as possible. Hey, thanks again for taking the course. I hope to see you in a future course.